Well, you just found out your neighbor was using your Wi-Fi to watch something nasty. Something so weird that even the book of fetish, this one, this one, and even this one does not have a name for that shit. And now you want to kick them out of your network because you don't want FBI knocking up on your front door. Hey guys, Vizio here and today in this video I'll be showing you guys how you can kick people out of your Wi-Fi network. I made a video similar to this about a year ago using one method that still works but uh, some people were having troubles using that method. So I am bringing you this foolproof new updated method that will help you kick people out of your network. Obviously uh, that method is a little bit easier so if you want something easy you can obviously go ahead and watch that. I'll make sure to leave it on the screen right now. It's in the i button. You can click on the i button and go watch that video. I'll also make sure to leave it in the description. So before starting this video make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to subscribe if you don't want to miss any new videos that we upload and follow me on Instagram. Yeah, I post some good technological content that you wouldn't want to miss. Now after that long ass intro, let's get started with how to kick people off your Wi-Fi. So we'll be using a Wi-Fi analyzer called Fing, but of course you can use any Wi-Fi analyzer that you like. This Wi-Fi analyzer for particular is available on both the iOS devices and the Android devices and it is also available for your Windows PC and Mac OS. Once you open this Fing app, you would want to click on this button which says scan devices and once you click on that you will see a list of devices that show up. So as you can see I have this, uh, this is my computer and this is the device that I'm using right now. It is a OnePlus 6 Android phone. Uh, an easier way to identify that device would be uh, say you have a laptop and only a mobile device connected. So anything except that are your neighbor's computer or phones or the devices that they're using. So once you make a note of that, click on it, scroll to the very bottom, you will see something called MAC address. Now all you need to do is copy this MAC address onto your notepad or somewhere you can refer it back to once we're onto our PC, once we're onto the next step of the procedure. That's about it for our mobile device. Now moving on to the computer. Now we've switched back to our computer. All you need to do is log into your router setting. So if you do not know how to log into your router setting, I will make sure to leave a link in the i button right now. You can go ahead and watch that video. It will tell you how you can log into your router easily and it's available for both Mac OS and the Windows PC. Click on the Windows button, type in CMD. The, com the command prompt will pop up. Right click on it and click on run as administrator. Hit yes. Now here you need to type in a code which I will make sure to leave on the screen right now. It is called ipconfig. Hit enter. And here you have to make a note of your default gateway. So my default gateway is 192.168.1.1. Go onto the browser of your choice and type in this exact code 192.168.1.1. Hit enter. This will pull up your login page for your router setting. So I'll quickly be going over and entering in my username and password. If you do not know how to log into your router, make sure to watch this video which is in the i button right now. I've explained in detail in that video on how you can log into your router's setting and make any of the changes that you want to. I've shown both the methods for the uh, Mac OS as well as the Windows PC. So make sure to watch that video if you are having any troubles logging into your router's setting. And now the settings will open up. So as you can see there are many tabs such as network, security, application management and diagnostics. So the setting in particular that we're talking about is called Mac filtering. So this Mac filtering settings can be under your Wi-Fi settings, it can be under your network se settings, it can also be under your security settings. Now this will differ from router to router and depending upon your router, you will have to find that setting. So I'll quickly be going over network and I'll press Ctrl F and type in Mac. As you can see, it says 0 out of 0 search results. That means there are no Mac filtering settings on this settings page. So I'll close out of it. 
next i'll be moving on to security i'll type in mac again and as you can see i have this setting called mac filtering all i need to do is click on this setting now what i want you guys to do in order to help each other out go on to the comment section and tell us where did you find this mac filter on your router setting along with the name of your router in that way people with the same router will have ease of finding this setting and you'll be a good human okay now that you're a good human let me explain the mac filtering by default when you arrive on this page it will be set to disable enable the mac filtering and under the filtering mode make sure it is set to blacklist so what this setting would do it would blacklist only those certain mac addresses that you key in into your network settings so where, wherever you see an add button just click on add and enter in that mac address so the mac address that i copied from my oneplus 6 was d6 pe i'll be hiding most of this stuff once you've entered your mac address click on apply changes and click on apply changes again and now this mac address will be stopped from using your wi-fi network let me go over to my android device and show you real quick how it would look so as you guys can see if i go over to my network settings this corona is the wi-fi network name if i click on it it will just say obtaining ip address and it won't be able to get connected to your network so that's about it for this video guys hopefully make sure to subscribe for more videos like this for more technological hacks in the future make sure to comment if this trick worked for you or not and i'll see you in the next one Make you cry And I don't wanna fight with you